in the GSL studio in Seoul, South Korea. That's and right. it's going to be another excellent year for StarCraft II. This is a brand new start to WCS, resetting all the points. Everyone starts from zero, and we're going to see who will be the world champion this year at BlizzCon. That goal is absolutely everything, accumulating those points, making sure that you are victorious on all of these stages across the year, just so that you can get to BlizzCon. Never mind win BlizzCon. Uh-oh. Oh, my God. This is going to get really, really bad. MC has made a lot of mistakes. MC does not want to accept that he's been beaten here by San. But these things are, I think, is what MC needs. It's kind of wake up call to realize, okay, you know, I'm not uh, invincible. I have to actually do more. You get another whole level of problems pop up when you get older as a pro gamer, because you have to think about what you're going to do after the pro gaming life. In South Korea, you have to go to the military service for two years. It's mandatory. But someone's dad wants him to be a priest. His country wants him to be a soldier. All he wants to do is actually just go to BlizzCon and be this champion one more time. They've got to go out there and do it. Otherwise, they're just the next guy that gets tossed aside by the team. And in three months from now, no one in esports even remembers who they were. They're done. They're gone. It's brutal. This is the pinnacle, and you have to perform. No one remembers who came in seventh or eighth place. You finally arrive. Consider one of the best in the world. One of the best hundred in the world, maybe. But actually, it's barely begun, because then you have to start winning. There is nothing else inside their minds other than getting to BlizzCon, because that's how important BlizzCon is.